Hello, my beautiful sweets. Happy Friday to everyone, or Friday. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, Sweet Sadie J TV. Today I have a medium to large Dollar Tree haul to share with you guys. You might see me in this t-shirt in other videos because I'm trying to catch up with my videos because I'm going out of town this weekend to visit my sister in Rocky Mount. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to record and run to the Dollar Tree and attend the seminar that we are attending this weekend. So without further ado, welcome back everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love and support you show my channel. Let's jump right into this Dollar Tree haul. Okay, my sweets, I have a few um, repurchases here as per usual because the Dollar Tree is the place that I go first before I go to the Dollar I mean to any of the other stores like the Aldi's or Food Lion and I try not to go to Walmart as much as I possibly can but I went to Aldi's to grocery shop and I normally get my downy fabric softener from Aldi's if Walgreens or CVS doesn't have it on sale which they did not this week and Aldi's didn't have it. And all these did not have it. Sorry, you guys. So, yes, like I was saying, I picked up two of these smaller um, downy fabric softeners just to have in the house until I could find where I could get one from for a reasonable price, which I did end up getting a bigger one, which you'll see in another haul from Dollar General when I went up to Dollar General. But these are just, what, 10 fluid ounces, 12 loads. This is an ultra downy fabric softener, and I love the one in the green top. So I purchased two of those. I'm just grabbing and showing, as always, y'all. Grabbing and showing. I told you guys before, I love these Brutiful uh, iced coffees established in 2023. Oh, okay. I never noticed that before, but this is Latte Coffee Mocha Arabica Blend, and you get a 10.7 fluid ounce of the Brutiful. They have it in a vanilla, and they have it in this flavor. And these are my two favorite, if they didn't have a caramel, which I have not seen them in a caramel. The Best Buy dates on these are da -da 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 -da, February 24th, 2025, and they're both the same. And I really do enjoy these. I have to drink them in moderation like everything else, but I do enjoy them. And my sister and I are digging the lemon chilios. And before my local large Dollar Tree ran out, I just grabbed two more boxes, one for her and one for me because I have not eaten these in milk yet, you, you guys. I just fill a little cup or a plastic bag full of them and eat them like a bag of chips or popcorn. They're really, really good. Their uh, Best Buy is used by May 4th, 2024. So, yeah. Gluten-free, limited edition, frosted Cheerios. Yes, please. I love me some Cheerios, y'all. Okay. I got some more of my drinks to mix in to make my jug of Kool-Aid. I pretty much just grab anything so that I can have a flavorful jug. This is the Zero Sugar Sun Kiss, the grape. You get six sticks, and its Best Buy is August 2026. Looks like that. And then I got, uh, how would you like a nice Hawaiian punch, okay? <laughs> Sugar-free, fruit juicy red, on the go. This is eight drink mix packets. And it's Best Buy is August 1st, 2025. So it looks like this. And all I do is I buy one big container like this for Food Lion. I usually go for the Fruit Punch or the Grape. But I went for the Pink Lemonade. And they come in one big pack like this. And I mix it with a couple of those mixes and two of my True Lemon uh, mixes packets. And I make a whole, almost a whole jug of Kool-Aid. And it lasts me for days. So, okay, let's see what else we're going to move on to. Okay, my sweets. I've seen these before in the Dollar Tree. But they decorated them in the, like, Christmas motif. And they put them down with the Christmas candy. And they just called my name. I've explained to you guys before how much I love my lollies. 
especially the Charms Blow Pops, but they have them in the resealable pouch, Charms Blow Pop Minis. It's a blow pop with no stick, and they're all the flavor of cher cherry and sour apple. It's a net weight of three ounces, which is about 41 pieces, and it's Best Buy is $7.25. They just were so cute, you guys. Look at the snowflakes and the Christmas lights. And I was just like, hey, you know, we could just knock out the middleman and get rid of this stick. So I will be sharing these. I'm going to take a pack up to my sister because when she comes to my house, she enjoys the lollipops too. But when I was picking these, I thought they were different flavors because of the packaging. But they're not. They're all cherry and apple. And it says up there actual size so yeah knock out the middleman right so let's put that over here and then they had this one which was, i thought was so cute and again they're all cherry and sour apple and the date is 725 so you got that one in the green you see the little christmas wreath and the lights I thought they were so cute. They got me, y'all. They got me. Because I've been seeing these in the Dollar Tree for a while, and I never purchased them. But it's okay. Like I said, we just cut out the middleman. And then they had this one that looks like Santa's feet or the stockings in the chimney. And again, just so cute. These are great little stocking stuffers for your kids. You know, great little gifts for your, um, your co-workers. And it just says, it's a blow pop with no stick. So yeah, the the um the Best Buy also seven twenty five. I thought they were so cute, so I grabbed those. I'm trying to um film all the stuff that I'm planning on taking to Rocky Mount, so that's probably why you're gonna see me in the same T-shirt. It's one of my Avenger T-shirts that Miss Pamela sent me, and it's so comfortable. It's beautiful out today, you guys. So. It's not that cold. I've already been up and gone to the food pantry, and that's coming up in another haul, okay? But my sister, she loves these Pure Line cream-filled wafers in the dark chocolate. Now, they did have them in the milk chocolate as well, but she's a fan of the dark chocolate. So I just picked her up a box of these because they're the bigger ones, wider ones. doesn't really say how many. It's just a net weight of 3.25 ounces. And it's Best Buy or used Best Buy 10 October 9th, 2024. So I got her a box of those to take up with her. I should just save them and put them in her Christmas bag, but I'm not. And these are a um, few new items that I found. They're not new. I found them like a month ago when I was in Rocky Mount at my sister's and I went to her, her Dollar Trees or the Dollar Trees in her area. And I found the Twinkies uh, candy canes. I didn't purchase them at the time. I don't know why, but, you know, I just get the candy canes and hang them on my Christmas tree. So I went light this year, y'all. Unless I see something that's really popping that we haven't seen, y'all know what I mean. <laughs> Ooh, that rhymed. That I got one box of the six um, Twinkies. I have no idea what these taste like. I know I tried the Twinkies popcorn and I wasn't a fan, a big fan anyway. I mean, it was just, it was okay. It was just really, really sweet. Um, this Best Buy date is June 20th, 2025. So these will go hanging on my tree until somebody comes in and says, can I have one? And I say, of course, of course. And this one is for me. I really wanted to try these. I've explained to you guys before how much I love my hot chocolate. So these are the hot cocoa candy cane. I don't know. I can't remember if we had these last year. I don't think so because I would remember them. And I didn't purchase any last year, so I don't think we had these last year. So this is hot cocoa candy cane, six count. And I'm trying to find your Best Buy or you, June 15th, 2025. So they look like that. They look good, right? You can put them in your cup of hot chocolate, your hot cocoa. So, yeah, I forgot to get my hot cocoa from Aldi's when I was there, too. And it's a little bit cheaper than it is at um, the Dollar Tree. So, just for your FYI. And it's delicious. Really, really good. Okay, two new items that I found that kind of shook me was these Twix 
ready to eat cookie dough bite size Twix candy bar pieces mixed into delicious cookie dough. You get about 50 pieces per box. It's a 3.1 ounce box. It's like the movie theater box. Y'all know the candies that we take to the movies. And this is Best Buy June 7th, 2024. I thought that was very interesting. So I will give it a try. Not that I need these sweets, but you know, I don't think you get a whole lot in here. I think it's just a small little package. I've never seen these before, so let's examine what we're getting here. Oh, okay. It's quite a bit, you know. So it looks like little cookie dough with, the, I guess, the Twix candy bar pieces in it. So that's what it looks like. Not bad for $1.25. Yep. So I got that, and I was quite excited to find it. Excuse me. And then I found the Snickers cookie dough bite size. Snickers candy bar pieces mixed into the delicious cookie dough. It says the same thing. And it's Best by June 21st, 2024. And it looks like this. Doesn't that look scrumptious? I love me some uh, Snickers, y'all. So I'm excited to try those when I get that little sweet tooth. Because, yeah, y'all know. And another new item that I've never, ever seen. This is called Toad Alley Snacks. They had it right next to the chocolate-covered pretzels that we get by the other brand. I can't think of it right now. But my large Dollar Tree had these. This is Toad Alley Snacks White Fudge Covered Pretzels. It's a three-ounce bag. It says no trans fat, no artificial flavor, no artificial color. And I'm not typically a white chocolate person, but I have been stepping outside the box here lately, and it's been okay. It's been okay. I must have not liked white chocolate when I was a kid. But you know, as you grow up, your taste buds change. So this is Best Buy October 25, October 25th, 2024. And I've never, ever, ever seen anything like that. Not by that brand. I've seen the white chocolate pretzels by the other brand, but not by this brand. So, yeah. It doesn't really tell you too much about it. It just says they're totally awesome. That's it. So, yeah. I got one bag to give it a try. All right. Okay, my sweets. The last of the food item is I found the Dole Mixed Fruit in Black Cherry Flavored Gel, gel Naturally and Artificially Flavored. It says fork under lid, 150 calories per cup. And it says caution may contain pits or pit fragments. Ugh. So I've been seeing these in most of the Dollar Trees that I've been um, visiting. And I just picked up one because I'm not really a big fan of the Jello with the fruit. But my sister is. But I'm going to let her have this. I'm going to take this to her. And when you open the top, you see the little fork right there in, in the middle and of course it is sealed praise god okay because <laughs> y'all know i don't buy nothing uh, nothing food wise that's not sealed so but yeah this expiration date is um third 24 i think that's what it says hold on hold on hold on oh july 19th 2024 so i did get one of those looked interesting okay and out of the food item, I think that's it on the food stuff. And then we're going to go into the non-food stuff. And this is a Premier Plus 7-Day Pill Organizer. We've seen these before. We've all purchased. Most of us have purchased them. I love mine, but I lost my Saturday. Not a deal breaker, right? But you know, I'm OCD, okay? So they've recently restocked all of my local Dollar Trees with these. They were out of them for a while. I even believe they came under a different name. I don't know. I can't I can't really remember because I threw the packaging away. But they're dated and the dates will eventually rub off or fade away. Also on the top where you see the um, sun and the moon. You um, touch these enough, which I use them every day. Their, their labels will um, come off or rub off. 
which again, they're color coded. And at the end of the day, it really, really doesn't matter. You just know you're taking your meds seven days, but I had to get me another one. Okay. So don't come at me y'all. I had to get me another one. And as you can see, the Saturday is missing. So I have my little pill here and I thought this was such a great idea to take when you go and you're spending the night somewhere, okay? And all you got to do is take one for that day. Well, I lost my Saturday. I left it behind. So if I probably had had the whole thing with me, I probably would not have forgotten my Saturday. I probably would have put it right back in here. So I will be taking the whole thing with me this weekend. So I don't have any issues leaving it. I believe it's at my sister's house somewhere, but... She claims she hasn't seen it yet. So, anywho, let's move on, okay? Everybody's been showing these. These never made it to my local Dollar Trees. Still, to this day, they have not made it. Everything else in the beauty intuition stuff so far made it to both of my local Dollar Trees. But these two items, I don't know. Well, I think it's three because I didn't get one. I only got two. But this is the beauty intuition um, bold bright lipstick, smooth application, moisturizes and hydrates, rich color. I got one in ru uh, ruby red and I got one in mocha. And they, y'all seen these, everybody's seen them. So I did get one of each. I did not get the pink because I don't do pink. So I really, really love it. And when you take these out, the writing on the tubes are really cute. Hmm. It says um, color. <laughs> so it just says color. The packaging is really cute. But you know Dollar Tree will really get us with the packaging. So then you open it up. And this is a... Oh, it does smell like chocolate. Everybody said it smells like chocolate. So that is the mocha, right? No, that's the ruby red. Looks cute. Hmm. Got to swatch it a couple of times, y'all. But that's cute. Meshes with my complexion. So, yeah, I could rock that. I don't know about that chocolate smell, though, because that'll make me hungry. And then this is the mocha one, the one that I wanted the most. And, again, it just says color, if you can see that on the packaging. And then you open that up. Oh, God, do they smell. This is broken. Ah, oh, daggone it. This one came out broken, you guys, and it flipped out on the floor, so we're just going to go from here, and I don't even like this color anyway, so it's not looking real good, and so that's what the mocha looks like, but woo-wee, do they really smell like chocolate? All right, let me pick this up. Okay, my sweets, I was able to save that piece that fell. It fell right on the base. Straight, sticking straight up, so I just wiped it off with a tissue, and then I rolled the roll up, and then I just jammed it down into it, so I was able to save it, just in case you want to see. I was like, okay, in, just in case I want it, you know, so I was able to push it back down, just a little lipstick on the, on the side, but woohoo, chocolate. All right, moving right along, I found these Be Pure Moisturizing Lip Mask. This is Seriously Soft Lips. Helps moisturize and soften lips with hydrolonic acid and shea butter. You get one mask, which is 1.05 ounces. I thought that was interesting to put into friend mail and giveaway mail. So somebody might like that. And then I found the Brightening Under Eye Mask. And I showed you guys the under eye mask and the eye mask. I don't know if it was some B Pure or B Color that they have in the two-pack, but I found these first. So this is Brightening Under Eye Mask. Be you. Help brighten your day with refreshed under eyes with collagen and caffeine. And you get one pair. So I'll see if my sister wants that. If not, I'll put it in friend mail in giveaways. Okay. And the next item I found, y'all know my hauls have been sitting here. I showed you guys these in a previous walkthrough a while ago. This is the limited edition brand lip care chapstick. This is the pumpkin pie. And y'all know, I told you before, my sister is a pumpkin head, but I'm probably gonna open these up and split them and just, you know, save some for friend mail or giveaways. So they look like this, pumpkin pie. 
and it's a brand name. So I was like, wow, that's cute, and you get three of them. So I don't know how well they work. Limited edition. I don't know. When you get three, I kind of get concerned, but I'm sure they're okay. It's just a lip balm. So I did get those. Pumpkin pie, okay? <clears throat> And these, I was telling you guys a while ago, you probably don't remember, but these are the floss sticks that I like the most out of the Dollar Tree. And I had thrown away the package, so I couldn't remember um, which ones they were. But as soon as I saw them, I recognized them. And I found these down in Virginia, along with the pumpkin pie and a few other items. But these are the Earth Loving Minty Grin Smooth um, Gentle Floss Tape. Um, 60 flossers and I love these because they have that wide wide piece right there so it doesn't string up or um, you know get stuck in your teeth and then of course they have the small pick on the back so while I was there and I saw them I picked up two packs of my favorite dental flossers I'm hoping they'll keep these because for the longest time we were out of them As a matter of fact I haven't seen these in my, my local stores and I don't know when I had to go on the road to find these. So I was happy to find that. And I think that's almost it, you guys. I got a few Christmas items to show you. And that'll be the end of this haul. Thanks for watching, guys. Okay, my sweets. The next few items that I'm going to be showing you are all from the South Hill, Virginia store. Because my stores don't have this stuff, okay? But I found these cute little yard stakes um, for my patio. And I just could not resist. Look at him. Look at him, y'all. <laughs> He's so cute. Santa with his Christmas tree. And, you know, they're just little yard stakes. So I have planters on my patio where I'll be able to stick these in so that they will be seen. Especially once I put my Christmas lights up. Because I bought the bomb set of Christmas lights last year from Amazon. And I absolutely love them. They have certain, so many modes. So blinkers, flashers, slow, fast, all that other stuff. Anyway, I found this one. I found all three of these um, at the same time. And this is the, is this a little girl or a little boy? I don't know. I think it's the little girl. This is the little girl with her, yeah, there's her little puffs, her little Afro puffs. So, <laughs> I just thought they were so darling. Look at her. Oh my goodness. I was so happy to find these. I got the Christmas tree ones that I showed you guys earlier. I, I'm a little, you know, perturbed at myself because I said I was going to go easy on Christmas, like I always say. But if y'all can see the pile of Christmas stuff that I've already accumulated, I need to be slapped. And I heard a manager in the back stock room saying that they waited until the very last minute to put out all the new Christmas stuff. So I'm telling y'all, hold on to your bootstraps because I know it's coming, all right? But anywho, I digress. <laughs> but I got the little boy one with the um, Christmas presents in his hands. And look at his big eyes. They look like me. Oh, my God. So darling. I fell in love when I saw these. And they're just calling them yard stakes, which is exactly what they are. So I got those. <clears throat> And then I can't remember because I've seen so many decors. I'm totally confused. I might have saw these in the very beginning when they first started putting out the Christmas stuff. But for some reason, when I got down there to Virginia, they just looked so new to me. But as I came home, they started, my memory started going. And I'm like, Sadie, you saw these in the very beginning and you didn't get them. So... I digress, y'all, but I got them down at South Hills, and I only went light. I didn't, yeah, I think I have the dish towel. I don't know, but this is the oven mitt by Christmas House, and it just says, marry everything with the gnomes, with the melanated nose and the little yellow nose, and it just says the snowflakes in the back, and y'all know, I only use this stuff for decoration. I do not use this stuff, you know. Um, to cook with or anything. I save it for decorations. And if I don't want it, because I know every year Dollar Tree's coming out with more stuff, then I'll just donate it. So I got the oven mitt, and then I got the two-pack of the pot holders, Just so, you know, I could decorate my kitchen like I always do. 
Aren't they cute, though? Look at that. I'm just like, oh, my Lord. Red on the back. You know, I don't know what the material is. Distribu uh, distributed by Greenbrier um, Canada. I don't know what that says. But, yeah, they are 100% cotton, you, you guys. I don't know if you can see the little background here. The little different colors, but they are so darling. So out of all of the ones, and I pretty much collected the the plaid Christmas um, set this year. A few little dishes. I did, I think, go back and get the charger plate. I'm not sure. You'll see it in an upcoming haul. But that is it for now, my sweets. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I hope you saw what you like, and I pray that you find it. Everyone, have a blessed day. Bye, guys.